a circuit is a connection between patient and machine so again this is patient this is the airway and this is the anesthesia machine every circuit will have a machine end now in closed circuit inspiratory limb and the expiratory limb of the circuit was was separated unidirectional valves was attached okay so now let's see how the gas moves from machine the fresh gas enter the inspiratory gas enter it enters through this one way valve only in the inspiratory limb only in the inspiratory limb so what are the gases nitrous oxide <coughs> oxygen and your isoflurane so this enters the patient now patient expire expiratory gases enter the expiratory limb through this one way valve so what is the expiratory gases nitrous oxide nitrous oxide oxygen iso and carbon dioxide in expiratory limb a very important new component was added that is called carbon dioxide absorber this has small 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 granules present in it made up of some chemical substance when the expiratory gas passes through it this chemical present in these granules react with carbon dioxide and carbon dioxide is absorbed and rest of the expiratory gases are recycled into the inspiratory limb so this is circle system the gas is not moving to and fro it is moving in a circle and we are not dependent on the fresh gas flow for removal of carbon dioxide co2 is removed by a chemical reaction so requirement of fresh gas flow is very minimal so this circuit became very very economical